Rosemary West was born in North Devon. She was a nervous child, not very bright. Her father was a monster. Miss A was close to breaking down as she began to give evidence of a similar assault on herself. She said Rosemary West had appeared very different. She was aggressive and spoke with a harsh voice one minute and was motherly the next. It's said that male serial killers tend to hunt their victims. We now know that the girls had fallen prey to the Wests as they cruised the area in a search for victims. Whether it's for sexual gratification or to exert their power and control, whereas female serial killers may lure their victims. Violence and serial killing is not the preserve of men. Of course, men are overwhelmingly the perpetrators. Maybe 85, 90% of all serial killers are male but females are capable of committing atrocious crimes. A fascination with horror seems an inescapable facet of human nature. Detectives, police, police are concentrating the search in this the search for body. The trial of Rosemary West is an international story. Rose was just sucked into this world. It was a collaboration in every way. Sex games, torture and murder. They subjected her to horrific sexual abuse and humiliation. Fred West had threatened to shut her in the cellar. Fred repeatedly raped her. Or bury her under the paving stones of Gloucester. In the presence of Rose, who actively encouraged this. There are hundreds of girls. Miss Owens claims she was subjected to further serious sexual assault.